Hello everybody, this is Christina with Tatter Rose Studios and um, I just wanted to show you another um, card that I made that um, I will be adding to my greeting card line on my website at tatterrosestudios.com and this one I'm getting ready to ship out um, tomorrow. This is for actually for my cousin. She's having a baby shower this weekend and since I won't be able to be there because they're out of state, um, I am sending her this gift. And I've already showed you the video um, of the pennant that I made for her. The I have it already tied up in a bow and ready to ship. But you saw the video uh, of this pennant um, thing that has her daughter's name on it. It says Nicole. So I have that all set and get ready to go. But then I decided to make a card for her. So the card that I made, this is the first time I ever made it and um, it didn't quite turn out the way I had planned. Um, the sizing of the, this is a, a box card and the size of the box is not um, big enough to hold the little mini that I made for it so I guess it's gonna have to be separate but um, so I was kinda bummed about that but other than that I love the card um, I cut this little scallop piece on my Cricut and this is the little pregnant mama um, greeting farm stamp and then um, on the back I, um, I have this band all the way around it that I made with this cute sequence elastic and then I just um, poked a brad through it with a cute little flower. So I'll take that off because it's, it's just holding on, holding the card closed. There's that. And then this is the card. Um, and I, I found this cute little dog on um, on Google and I printed it out and colored it with my Copics and then I also cut this this heart out on my Cricut and then I just added a few little flowers here and um, I did the little puppy because she has her baby for a long time now has been her little puppy and now she's finally having her little girl that she's never had before so she's going to have her little baby puppy and her new little daughter. And then as the box card opens, it opens like this. And then the little sentiment is on the inside. And um, I did make a, made a little mini for this, but and it fits in here. It just, I can't get it to fold and close. So that may really bummed me out. I thought it would, would have been really cute, but now I have to send it separate. Um, the inside, just I found this cute little sentiment um, on the website. It's called "A Baby Is Cuddles and Tickles on Ten Little Toes, the Sweet Scent of Powder, and a Kiss on the Nose." Wishing you all the best with your new bundle of joy. So that's what it says, and I'm gonna sign it on the inside. But then I made, to go inside the card, I made this cute little brag book. And it's made with um, two chipboard pieces for front and back. And also on the back of everything, um, I stamped my little uniquely handmade limited edition and I cut it out and distress it and everything. I also did the same on the back of my cards. I do that on the back of all my cards. And I also did on the back of the little mini. But um, but these are little chipboard pieces. Um, this card is um, four by four, four by four. And so I made this three, um, three and a half by three and a half the chipboard pieces I did and then um, have one of my spare parts um, jumbo blings and my spare parts flower and then I found this cute little baby online and I um, 
cut out and colored with my Copics. And I have some Recollections Bling. And I just stamped on the side Brag Book. And then this is also, this is a little rosebud that I got um, from Michaels in the $1.50 section. And then I just tied some cute ribbon around it. And then on the inside, I just have little um, pages with for pictures and then little pockets for journaling. And all the pockets are the same, so I'm not going to take them all out. But And all the pages are the same as well. They're all the same. So it's just a little brag book that she can use for her new baby. And I wanted it to go inside here. See how it just fits like that? It's really cute. But I'm having trouble um, closing it, which really bums me because that's the whole point of, of me spending the time in making this album. So I was really bummed about that, but I guess she's going to have another little separate thing. So, um, so that is what I made. And then this just goes right back on here. Like that. Whoops, let me move it so it doesn't cover up the puppy's face. Puppy's so cute. <clears throat> Come on. Just trying to turn it around a little. So, so there's the card and the little brag book. And when I put this on my website, it's going to come with the little brag book, but um, I'm going to figure out and I'm going to make it a tiny bit smaller or not, not so much smaller, but just thinner. That way it fits better in here. And so um, this card will be on my website for sale. It will be a little bit more money than the other ones because it does come with a little mini inside, but um, it's going to be a wonderful addition to my greeting farm or my greeting card collection so hope you like it and um and like if, if you want to order this card it doesn't have to be the pregnant mama and a baby brag book it could just be it could be a different greeting farm character and it could be a, you know a totally different theme so you just put that in the comments um when you email me and when you order just let me know and we will accommodate whatever theme you'd like but this is the what it will mainly look like um, except for this will be just a little bit thinner and um, that's about it the size will probably stay the same just that's like I said the thickness is just it's just too thick so um, hope you like that and um, my pennant will also be on my website. Um, it can be any theme. It could say any word on it. Um, it can be anywhere from 5 to 12 um, pennant flags. This one is 8. So, um, and it only goes, up to, only goes up to 12. So like I said, it can say anything you like. I will also put that on my um, on my website as well for purchase. Um, I don't believe it's not going to be in the greeting farm or the greeting card collection um, section of the boutique. It will be in um, you know I'm not sure which section it's going to be in yet. Um, it might be in the original art. Um, section. Um, I don't believe we have a miscellaneous section, so um, it will probably be under original art. So if you're looking for that, um, it'll be under that. And if you have any questions, um, please ask me. Um, if you have any comments, I'd love to hear them. Any suggestions, um, critiques, anything. Um, I love to hear them all. And I hope you guys have a great day. Have a great day. Bye-bye.